Hey guys, this is Kadeen and you are watching Grow with Kadeen. In this video, you will learn that how you can create a medical healthcare or clinic website without coding within 10 to 20 minutes. And uh, if I'll give you the overview of the website here, you can see first of all, there is a home page, then about services, teams and testimonials, blog and contact page. And if you'll scroll down here, you can see all the sections required for a professional clinic website are available there. And these types of website takes about uh, thousand to two thousand dollars to be designed and you can design this complete website within 10 to 20 minutes but without uh, before just getting started let me just tell you that I am running a web design and digital marketing agency so if you want premium quality and professional website uh, designed by professionals and you want to hire someone professional you can hire us uh, you can just visit out our website or in description you will find my personal whatsapp number uh, my personal email and Instagram as well so you can just contact me through any medium and we can just uh, talk about that and I'll be telling you that how you can create the website uh, uh, what would be the process we'll be creating your website and then if you would need SEO maintenance or social media services we can also help you with that uh, so uh, if you uh, don't have time and you are a business owner so you can just hire secondly if you are a freelancer and you are learning WordPress then I would recommend you this course the link is in description why this course uh, let me just go below uh, uh, here you can see in this course I have uh, taught you that how you can create uh, uh, 80 plus types of business websites within 20 minutes then I have told you that how you can just get clients with very professional ways which I use to get uh, clients for my agency from YouTube from Google from classic search engines Quora and agencies then how you can just manage your clients how you can send proposals how you can automate payments and uh, keep connected with the clients and then some productivity hacks and I would um, recommend you to must check this code to start a website there are two uh, basic things that you must need and these are domain name and hosting without domain name and hosting you can not uh, publish a website now if you don't know what the domain name and hosting is domain name is basically the name of the website and hosting is basically a storage where all your website files are stored um, and that uh, space uh, storage is 24 7 connected to internet uh, we cannot manage it because it's a lot technical so there are several companies providing these services but I would recommend you Bluehost why because we are using WordPress to design our website and this is the web hosting recommended by WordPress and the second reason is that I am their affiliate so if you will go from the link in description below you will get the free uh, 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 domain name of for free with free SSS, uh, SSL certificate and web hosting starting from $2.95 per month and uh, there are a lot other reasons like their uh, chat support and the, all their professional services and there must, must be a reason that WordPress is also recommending Bluehost and uh, then what you just have to go, go uh, do is uh, just go to link in description and uh, click on get started now and uh, there you will see three packages basic plus and choice plus and I would recommend you going with uh, this plus plan because with basic plan you can just create one website with 50 GB space and you have all the features uh, there but uh, in plus plan you can create unlimited websites you can uh, you have unmetered uh, website space unmetered bandwidth performance is standard and free SSL certificate unlimited included domain and everything is unlimited I and I would recommend you go with that and if you want more uh, speedy and uh, fast hosting then you can go with choice plus so, so just select this one now enter a domain name here hadeenclinic.com now here you would have to enter your details all your enter all your details and then uh, select the plan if you want to buy for 12 months or 36 months and after uh, going with that I would recommend you 12 months be why because first uh, you can just check the Bluehost if it suits you but if you want a uh, website is not top priority for you then select it for 36 months so you will also get a standard discount and then when will you go below here you can see there are a few few options so you can just disable these two options if you don't want that but I would recommend you code hard basic because it has uh, website backups and all that features 
and after that i will just go below and here you would have to enter your payment information uh, you can just pay with credit card debit card or if you want to pay with paypal just click on more payment options and here you can pay with paypal as well and then click there and click on submit and they will ask you for uh, creating a password and you would have to create the password and after password you would be redirected uh, you would be given the details and redirected to the bluehost admin panel now after uh, going to the admin panel just click on that login to wordpress and you will be redirected to this uh, wordpress dashboard where you would be creating the website so right now this is our website that's how our website is looking right now and we have to convert this website into this website so uh, you can see the time left in, in that time left will be converting this website into this website so the first step in uh, just uh, creating the website is uh, getting a wordpress theme which is rishi theme and uh, the medical demo for that theme is for free so what you just have to do is you just have to go to link in description below or just type in webifyhub.com slash rishi you will be redirected there just click on download rishi for free enter your details here and click on download now and after clicking on download now uh, your invoice would be created and your purchase is completed now click on this rishi and download this wordpress theme file and after this theme file is downloaded what we would do is we would go to this website the admin dashboard and upload our rishi wordpress theme now that the theme file is downloaded just go to appearance go to themes click on upload click on upload theme click choose files and upload this rishi theme and click on install now and after this theme is installed uh, just click on activate and now rishi wordpress theme has been activated now click on install rishi companion above that rishi companion has also been installed and now you would have to import the uh, medical demo first then we'll be customizing the complete website now to import the uh, demo website uh, we'll just click on starter sites click on install rishi starter templates and after it's installed uh, what, what you just have to do is just search medical here so here you will find the medical uh, wordpress theme demo so here is the medical demo if you want to preview it just click on preview to preview the complete website but as we have already previewed it so I'll just click on import here you have two options to import home template or to import complete site so I'll just click on import complete site delete previously imported sites and uh, select all that and click on import and after some time your complete website would be imported now that you can see within a matter of few seconds the website has been imported successfully so I'll just click on view site and here you can see what's the difference between this and this website I'll just make it a bit little bigger sorry and uh, now I think you can't find any difference between this site and this site the, these are uh, completely completely like uh, uh, cloned websites now uh, what's the next step we would have to change the name of the website tagline uh, this uh, e email etc and um, uh, we would have to change the logos and we would have to change the footers and then insider content uh, this is the basic setup of the website again I want to tell you that if you want to hire someone professional like you want uh, to integrate structured data want to integrate pixels and uh, 
add SEO plugins and more advanced customized features into your website with advanced theme then you can hire someone and I think we are the best option for you but you can hire anyone for that uh, so first of all we'll be editing header and after editing header we'll be editing the footer and uh, after that we'll go on to the insider section to customize the header and footer uh, you will just have to click on this customize button above and after clicking on this customize button above uh, you will see this type of uh, a customizer bar a uh, customizer page where you will be customizing your website header and footer and logos and stuff first of all we'll change this phone number and all that and then we'll go on to the logo so just click on this pencil icon click on this drop down and from here you can just change the phone number just change the phone number and uh, to change the email just go there and change the email me at khadeenakbar.com and if you want to add an address here just click on address and click add and here you can see address is all way all uh, also visible here just remove the title field and here you can see now you have address as well now if you want to change these uh, social icons just click on this pencil icon and from here you can add or remove uh, uh, the social icons like uh, you want to remove the LinkedIn you can remove the LinkedIn uh, you want to add uh, the parlor you can add and click on add to add it and you can remove uh, unnecessary platforms uh, and um, how to edit their links I'll tell you uh, but right now uh, so let me just tell you first that how to edit those links so just go back and here you have social uh, network uh, uh, option and go there and in each section add the links there and like that just go to each section and paste the the link of your social profile there and after doing that I think we don't have to edit this menu because it's already set it up but we have to edit this uh, logo so I'll just click on this pencil icon and uh, would we'll change it to logo only and uh, click on that pencil icon just go to upload files click select files and select your company's logo you want to upload and it should be 300 pixels uh, by almost 285 pixels it the logo is uh, 300 pixels by 105 pixels and just click select and here you go the logo has been uploaded from here you can just change the logo's max width and uh, here you go your logo has been edited as well now just go below to edit the footer now and to edit the footer just go to each section like let's go to about sec about our section and from here you can just change the about text like you are using microsoft word and uh, then uh, to uh, don't play around with this recent post but you would have to change this one so uh, just change the text from here as uh, it's saturday to sunday let's suppose you want to make it Um, um I, I think it's uh, good to go and uh, then you have this uh, social icons option and it's same as the header and then you will have to go below and here uh, you will have to change the theme developer or website developer so powered by webified hub I'll add my company name you can add yours and add a link here 
that's all and click on publish and you don't have to play around with this one uh, as well and one thing i just want to share that i am doing a lot minimal changes why i'm doing minimal changes because when you will try to uh, play around with things you will uh, mess uh, up the things and that is not good because uh, this theme has been designed by professionals web designers and front-end developers uh, front-end designers and uh, they have spent hours in designing that uh, thing and when you will play around with the colors and all that and uh, you will just mess up the things and website would never look professional um now uh, i'll tell you that how you can play around with colors a bit uh, you can just go to colors and from here uh, if you uh, your logo or color is different and you want your website to look a bit different so you can change the color scheme here like my logo is a dark blue and i'll make it dark blue as my website color uh, as my logos color i'll make it dark blue and this one i'll also convert it to blue one and that's all what you guys should do and uh, i don't recommend you going with other uh, modifications because it would just mess things up and uh, just click on publish and one more thing to edit just go below and uh, go to site identity and you would have to change the site icon as well just go to select files upload a 4x4 four four, uh, uh, 1 ratio 1 logo or 512 by 512 and uh, it should appear in this uh, tab just click on crop and here you can see uh, it has also been edited And now here are a few options uh, to you as well. So you, if you want to play around with these options, you can also play around with these options as well. Now I uh, will just have to click on publish. And your header has been edited. And now if you just want to change uh, the website name or tagline, just go to uh, your website.com slash WP admin into your dashboard. Just go to uh, settings general. And from here you can just change the website name and also uh, the tagline website by Khadeen Akbar. click save changes good to go and now I'll just click on visit site to see how our site is looking right now so here you can see the website is been completely changed and now we'll be editing the insider stuff how to edit the insider stuff just click on edit with Elementor and uh, from here we'll be editing the insider so here you can see the uh, Elementor page builder has been loaded and now what we would do is we would do the edits first of all let's make the screen a little bigger so that it's easy for us to edit and now I think we can edit the website easily so first of all if you want to change the background uh, but before just that let me just tell you that um, I would recommend you just go to youtube.com and search for Elementor tutorial and watch one of these elementary tutorials to get the basic understanding of elementor it might be 10 to 20 minutes but i would recommend you spending those 10 to 20 minutes if you want to just operate your site by yourself okay so first of all we'll be editing the section just click on edit section and just go to style to just change the background image I won't recommend you changing the background image as well because I let the website be as it is you have changed the color scheme and now I would recommend you just change if you want to change uh, these pictures and uh, if you are if you have these types of pictures then change them if you don't have just don't even change these pictures as well just change the text button links and that's all and your professional website will be created and if you want more professional stuff then I would recommend you to hire someone okay so uh, first of all uh, here you can see in this uh, uh, if you want to change the text just click on uh, the, this pencil icon and from here you can just uh, will take care of your 
health dude and here you can see I uh, just to show you that uh, when you will edit uh, the text here it would be automatically edited here now if you want to change these text uh, just click on edit button or just click on this text and from here you can edit the text you can bold it you can link it and do all that then button uh, you can play around with the button styles from here style section but I won't recommend you just playing around with it and uh, I've just uh, uh, if you want to change the text in the text section you can change the text and here you can just add the link to the appointment and what I would recommend is that uh, uh, assign an ID to this section like assign appointments ID to this section copy that ID just go there and paste it here when someone will click on book appointment and they will be redirected to this section and I think that's the best option I, I, or if you are using third-party services like Calendly what Calendly is I'll tell you at the end of the video uh, then you can just redirect the customers to that website and uh, and then if you want to change the picture just click on change the change picture click on choose image and from here you can choose the image and then uh, here uh, you can just change the text as well just click on the button and change the link uh, as I told you you can if you want to change this stuff uh, the, this is uh, the same process to change the text uh, to change these check boxes uh, just go to each one and change the text and uh, change the picture just go to each picture and change it then you have this one uh, just go to each section click on this button icon and you have the options to change it and it's a lot easy and now I am uh, afraid I, I am, that you would be angry if I would be just giving you each and everything and these things I think are really basic and you can just play around with them very easily but I am just giving you a basic insight that how easy it is to create website using Rishi WordPress theme if you want a basic website for your business and uh, then uh, from here you can just change the title and all uh, all that if you go to display section uh, uh, settings to just change the icon and uh, that's how you can edit all those and from here you can edit your services section and learn more button redirect this learn more button to each service page and uh, or just redirect it to services section and uh, from here you can uh, you can just uh, redirect it to services page so redirect um, uh, land each button to the services page and especially this one And then uh, below here you can see you have a why choose us section and uh, edit this why choose us section uh, add your content and this is a form I'll tell you that how you can edit this form as well um, how you can play around with this form and uh, to change this one this is a lot easy you just have to click on each thing and it would be edited uh, to edit the team you have all the things to be edited then latest new section don't play around with this and then this one uh, just a uh, change uh, um, uh, like it's a lot easy now what should I tell you uh, how to edit it now to change the email info at khadeenakbar.com that's uh, e how easy it is copy the link map link and paste it here and uh, that's all and just update the website and your website has been edited now we'll go to next page no, I won't be editing the each uh, each page one by one because we are not creating the website. We are just customizing the website, and it's a lot easy. And I won't just want to waste your time and mine as well because uh, I want to produce as much tutorials as I can and reach out to as much businesses I as I can to help them how to create the websites and uh, do the web design business and uh, all that stuff. So when you will go to about page, about page has also the same widgets and sections here. You can see, and these are also. Uh, same and uh, to be edited with the same way as then services section it's also the same as it is on the home page then you have team section it's also the same then testimonials and contact section and blog section is what you can edit from here uh, to, uh, here you can see there is a contact section and uh, 
uh, the blog section is basically edited from dashboard and from dashboard you can you can add new post and those new post would be editing in added in the blog section now let me just tell you that how to play around with the form appointment booking form and contact form and how to just change things on them uh, just go to this uh, contact and uh, go to contact forms and this is an extra basically so first of all uh, let's just edit this appointment form just go to edit and here you can see these are all the details and what you just have to do is just uh, copy all the details from here just go to mail um, uh, there are two options you can send this email to the admin email on which you just uh, created the website or you can choose your own email like i'll select this kadinakbar online at gmail.com and here what you just have to do is uh, you have to add all these details here and uh, from here uh, what you just have to do is basically basically paste it here and uh, now after pasting it here what you just have to do is you just have to remove this one um, and this one as well then this one and this one as well this one as well just keep the email here and uh, also remove this stuff okay so now you have that and um, here full uh, name mobile number and email and date now you will get a customized email and uh, now click on save now just reload the site enter your name email and uh, the date and uh, the phone number here click on make appointment after clicking there here you can see you have uh, these details in the email and when someone submitted the form you have all the details here it is a bit separated so what you can do is you can just customize the message and make it this type of uh, now I think it's ready to be sent and that's all your appointment form has been also been edited and that's all what you just have to do is and uh, uh, now what we would do is we, I would be just uh, uh, telling you about some uh, softwares and uh, uh, some uh, tools that can you that you can use uh, to just uh, uh, do more optimization and get advanced productivity now here is the list of some tools that you can use and the first one is WP Rocket. WP Rocket is basically to uh, it is a WordPress plugin to speed up your WordPress website and uh, uh, then uh, secondly you have uh, Elfside widgets just to visit that website you can add awesome widgets like uh, live chat uh, facebook reviews google reviews and a lot other awesome widgets to your website i would recommend you to go there to their website and just check it out and then uh, you have some tools like calendly calendly is basically for uh, graphic designing if you uh, want some uh, to design ads posts or anything else uh, or and wants templates you want to design presentations create videos and you don't want to pay anything to the uh, designer and you want to do it by yourself uh, then you can just uh, select this canva and basically the second one is Calendly and I just talked it uh, uh, first one is Calendly and I just talked it uh, secondly uh, so the Calendly is basically appointment booking software and, uh, and this is about which I told you uh, this uh, you can just sync Calendly with your calendar and uh, this is awesome appointment booking software and this is used by me and a lot other organizations and sales consultants and business consultants and uh, this is awesome software I would recommend you to must use it then with IQ Pro to get views on YouTube then you have SEM Rush to rank your website on Google Grammar 
primarily for better communication get response is basically for email marketing and hubspot is the recommended crm by me and uh, and uh, uh, after that you have my phone number my whatsapp and my email as well let me just add it right now email as well to just contact me for uh, any queries regarding web design digital marketing seo or promotion of your business thank you so much for watching the video see you in the next video till then stay safe take care goodbye